Missile locked. Kill. Missile locked. Proximity alert. Head. Kill. Proximity. Aegis combat assist. Activated. Systems green. Hello, and welcome once again to Mustache Life Gaming. Well, I decided we should have a look at yet another of Star Citizen's many wonderful spacecraft. Moving up from the Cartuel, we now have the Aegis Sabre. And so far, I rather like it. It's got a nice interior. And let's have a look at the exterior. That definitely looks like a Sabre, and it definitely looks like an Aegis. Not just with the uh, Aegis logo there, but look at the lines on it and the curves. That's what, that's what an Aegis ship is supposed to friggin' look like. Uh, I love their designs. I really, really do. The, uh, the dev team has done such a great job really setting a lot of the manufacturers apart, but especially, to me, so far, the Aegis series. Now, the Sabre is supposed to be the replacement to the Anvil Hornet F7CM Space Superiority Fighter, and uh, from just sort of screwing around with it for a little bit, I can, I can see that. It's got, uh, you can hear the punch in the lasers. It only really requires one pilot, uh, whereas the, uh, the Hornet F7CM to really, really function needs two. However, you are sacrificing a ball turret, which is totally okay. Because you still have all of these wonderful, wonderful lasers. You've also got, uh, see a triple platform, two triple platforms of missiles, which is great. We've got a pretty solid boost here, up to 390 from the 350, I believe, that the Hornet had. Uh, the max speed unboosted is 260. It's pretty good. A little bit up, I believe, from the Hornet. And it can turn pretty much all the time. Try that again. I lost the reticle. Uh, it's definitely a very loud ship, but uh, I'm I'm pretty okay with that. I don't know about you guys. Yeah, it seems like uh, most of the trouble turning around is my fault. But uh, hey, that happens. It's been a while since I've played a whole lot, but with the uh, the newest release, I'm kind of getting my my space legs back and. Uh, Checking out some of the new ships, such as the Car to Owl, the Proximity uh, Alert Head. Saber here that we've got. Let's actually hop out of the cockpit real quick, and take a slightly closer look, and then we're going to uh, we're going to hop over and check it out. Danger system uh, overheat. Some bad guys. Some of those nefarious evil Vanduul just want to eat our faces, or whatever it is they supposedly do. Um, I mean, look at it, though. The thing even looks like a fighter. There we go. Probably not in the most well-lit spot, but that's okay. Just look at the lines on it. That's, that's really nice. And I like that they had the, uh, the little folding wings in there to give it sort of a a carrier aircraft feel. Also, devs, if you if you read this or watch this, sorry, bit of a sinus infection. I'm a little off my uh, off my game today. But if you watch this, please hear my plea for a downward thrust in EVA. It just makes sense that we have one. Um, of course, I could just be dumb, and it's there, and I need to check my keybinds, but, uh, so far I haven't found it. So, anyway, really nice engines. Let's look at it from the front. 
again. Have a look at its, uh, its armament. That's pretty, pretty solid right there, if you ask me. Now, I actually don't see the missiles. Maybe I'm missing them. Perhaps they are tucked away somewhere. Yes, I would say that's it. Probably. Let's see what this says. Ow. Bump. Door is operational. So I'm going to say, yeah, that's... No, that's probably where the landing gear is. I have no idea where the actual ordnance goes. Oh well. Uh, it's not a major thing for me. As long as I know I have it. Um, anyhow, so that's... So that's the, uh, the pretty bits. Let's see what the, uh, the bitey bits do. We're gonna cut back in just a second. Anyhow... Let's do it to it. Let's see what kind of teeth this thing's got. Spoiler alert. Biggins. Hostile contacts remaining. All right, so not a very impressive first wave, but that's partially my fault. Proximity alert. Warning. Head. There are multiple hostiles inbound. Contact. Begin scan. Incoming enemy. Proximity alert. Head. Missile. Lock. Hostile contacts remaining. Contact. Elite units en route. Contact. Begin scan. Alright, time for little King and his buddies. And let me tell you guys, I came here to sell propane and kick ass. Head. I'm all out of propane. Oh! Lock. 
charge. Yeah. Proximity alert. Head. Proximity alert. Port. As you can see, Contact it's quite a sturdy little ship. Scan. Warning, there are multiple hostiles inbound. I'm actually rather Contact happy with it. It's incredibly maneuverable. It's also a very powerful vessel compared to uh, some of the, excuse me, some of the others that I piloted. And uh, it seems to be able to handle plenty of punishment without much trouble. And that's that's something I always look for because I tend to get shot at a lot. So I'm gonna sort of let this roll out. Uh, remember to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this or found it useful. Um, and be sure to check down in the description below for a link to the, uh, the website for Star Citizen. As well as a, uh, a code that will get you an extra 5,000 UEC just for signing up and becoming a backer for Star Citizen's development. Proximity alert. Head. Proximity alert. Head. Kill. Proximity alert. Starboard. Proximity alert. Deck. Proximity alert. Head. 